Am I the asshole? Calling out a friend's divorce because she wouldn't leave my husband alone. My husband works with a girl named Lucy who also happens to be part of our social circle. I wouldn't say she's close to us. But she's a close friend of a friend so we'll see her once in a while when there are group outings. She also works with my husband John. And I guess because we also see her outside of work. She thinks she's super close to my husband. I'm not a super jealous type. But I drew a line when my husband himself voiced discomfort at Lucy's behavior. She likes to make jokes about being his work wife. Try and push me out of conversations with my husband i.e. you weren't at the office. So you wouldn't understand. And has tried to initiated one-on-one -on -one hangouts with my husband. John has turned her down. And has also explicitly told her that she was making him feel uncomfortable and to stop. She's just laughed and brushed it off. And still continues. He hasn't brought it up to work yet because she's a single mom and he didn't want to get her in trouble. Her advances have mostly been just annoying. But it recently escalated which brings us to the issue. At a barbecue. My husband was sitting around a fire pit with his friends. I got up to get food. And I came back right as Lucy came and sat down on my husband's lap while joking. Your work wife can entertain you while your normal wife is busy. This was the first time she made a physical advance. And my husband immediately jumped up and pushed her off. She laughed and told him to stop being so sensitive. And I could tell it embarrassed my husband. It was at this point that I told her. Maybe if you had focused more on being a real wife instead of a work wife. You wouldn't be divorced. Lucy immediately left the party after that. And I found out from our friend that she cried in her car. She's since skipped and avoided all events where I'm there with my husband. Which has caused a strain with our mutual friend. Most of our other friends were on my side. But some said I was too harsh and that Lucy was just kidding around. Not the asshole. Lucy crossed a big line and needed to be put in her place. Publicly. It's probably the only way you and your husband could get her to stop. Bold and brazen while trying to cloak it as a joke. Wow. Not the asshole. Lucy is trying to steal your husband. Thankfully he's a good guy and isn't having it. Time for him to go to HR. There's a non-zero chance that she'll go first and report him for harassment. Good luck. Not the asshole. Lucy is lucky that she just felt your wrath rather than your husband going to HR like he should. I understand completely why your husband doesn't want to. There are probably two reasons. One he really doesn't want her to get in trouble and two it's embarrassing for a man to say they are being sexually harassed. You should probably tell your husband that he needs to go to HR about it. She shouldn't lose her job over one instance and she'll hopefully learn a very valuable lesson. Sexual harassment in the workplace isn't a game. Not the asshole. She was sexually harassing your husband. And not for the first time. Your comment was harsh. But that's apparently the only way to get her attention. She wasn't taking no for an answer. She needed to be called out. And harshly. Not the asshole she was told it made him uncomfortable. Her feelings on the matter no longer matter. It's the risk you take when you ignore polite boundaries. She taught you both that she wasn't going to stop. So you called her out. Natural consequence. She seems extremely insecure. Some said I was too harsh and that Lucy was just kidding around. Then go hop on their man's crotch and see if they laugh. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Whether it's due to her feeling insecure because of a divorce. 
or unrequited feelings towards your husband. None of Lucy's behavior is okay. Your husband has told her that he's not okay with her behavior. If this was a guy doing it to a girl, the shouts of sexual harassment would be far and wide. Just because a woman is the aggressor doesn't make it less offensive or wrong. Not the asshole. I never thought this type of burning could happen at a barbecue lol. On a more serious note, she was making your husband uncomfortable and he has voiced it multiple times. In all honesty if he hasn't already he should talk to HR if possible. Had the genders been reversed, Lucy would probably not have many people in her corner if any. Not the asshole. the moment she plopped her butt in your husband's lap was the moment she gave up. The right to be taken aside and told what she was doing was wrong. You were a lot nicer than I would have been in that situation. Not the asshole. Her gross behavior needed to be stopped. Entire and shame on your mutual friend for saying that was acceptable. She's made comments and was asked to stop. She escalated things and got physical. Then she's embarrassed about getting called out. Playing dumb games. Win dumb prizes. You were quick-witted and way more calm than I would have been. Not the asshole. Lucy is weird. Not the asshole. Lucy sounds unhinged. Honestly. Sorry you and your husband have to deal with that. Not the asshole. She's repeatedly ignored your husband's requests to back off. It was time you or your husband told her to cut it out. Not the asshole. She is literally sexually harassing your husband. The two of you would only be TA to yourselves. For not contacting HR about this. Her behavior is absolutely inexcusable. Imagine if a man did this to a woman your husband's harassment is only getting worse and frankly. People who sexually harass their co-workers deserve nothing short of being fired and publicly humiliated. Inta. You did the right thing. She's way out of line and desperate. If she persists with harassing your husband report her to their HRD. That's unbecoming. Not the asshole. Sitting on his lap and making the comment that she would entertain him while his wife was busy. Crossed the line. So far over the line she can't see the line in the distance. Especially when OP's husband had told her before that her bet was not welcomed. None of her behavior was kidding around and if the idiot how said that had someone behaving the same way towards their partner. They wouldn't be saying that it is kidding around. Not the asshole. Your husband needs to talk to HR at this point. Because there's every possibility that Lucy decides to go there first and make some shit up now. That she's been so directly called out. Fuck around met find out brilliantly handled and way to stand up for your husband not the asshole. You've done nothing wrong. Lucy is the biggest asshole in all of this. But your husband is also an asshole for not notifying HR. There are ways to do it without consequences for Lucy. And he should have done that much sooner. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Let's call it what it is sexual harassment. It isn't different because he is a man. I love the comeback. Not the asshole. What she's doing is sexual harassment and tbh she's lucky you called her out before it got her in. Hot water at work. The result of that would have been much worse. Not the asshole. Hubby should be documenting her behavior and reporting it at work. Not the asshole and he needs to report her to our. Honestly don't care that she's a single mom. Her behavior is harassment and in HR world can be viewed as sexual harassment especially if she makes a physical advance like that at a work function or at work. If she gets fired, it's through her own actions. 
not your husband's. Also that's a good comeback.